Hey guys, we are in the ruins of St. Augustine in Goa, India. Guys, this church is amazing. This is a big church, had eight chapels and four altars. Hi guys. Hi Bradley. I've never seen a church this beautiful. All that remains now is just a picture of what was a massive church. So the vault would have gone over like this. And the only big structure that remains is this tower. Basically, the reason why this church fell is because after the Portuguese left India, it fell into a state of neglect and disrepair, and everything just collapsed. The vault collapsed, and then other parts followed. Um, yeah. Now, this church is very special because Queen Ketavan the Mata's bones were actually found in this church. So look up Queen Ketavan the Mata. And it's amazing. There were lots of other historical things here to look at. I don't know where guys will find this stuff. It's so beautiful. Yeah, look at that. So many. Chapel of St. William. And the statues would have sat in that part there. Guys, this is amazing. And guys, just one thing. If you ever come here, you feel a sense of silence. And like... You take a walk back 300 years ago. This church was constructed in 1602. It's a really long time ago. So guys, if you ever do come to this church, please come and visit St. Augustine in Old Goa. Hi, Uncle. Hello. How are you? <laughs> Chapel of Our Lady of Good Success. Guys, uh, this church is massive, and this vault would have towered, just absolutely towered in the sunlight that we see now. It's amazing, isn't it? Guys, if you ever come to Goa, please come to St. Augustine. The ruins, it's a breathtaking sight to see. See you guys. Bye.